first experience with Blue Cross Blue Shield, I guess, is when I busted my chin. And I was a kid in Michigan. And I remember my dad had Blue Cross Blue Shield. We, it seems like we've always, it's always been a part of our family in our businesses. My father and I started a company in 87 and I decided to leave to start my own company. We've made the top 100 fastest growing companies two years in a row uh, through Dun & Bradstreet and Fortune magazine and uh, we're, we're pretty successful. I think for this industry in the type of high skilled uh, employees we're trying to retain, you have to offer uh, competitive benefits. You know, and the Blue Cross Blue Shield name is well renowned around this area, and it's uh, it's a good value for the money, and uh, and the, and it's a good recruiting tool for us as well. It does says a lot about a company that um, has Blue Cross Blue Shield as you know their insurance carrier. They offer the best value, um, and it's affordable. Things has been really easy and seamless um, up until my wife became pregnant somehow. All I did was pay a few co-pays, but um, after going through all the pregnancy and C-section and post-op and all of that fun stuff, I've really get, had to interact a lot with Blue Cross Blue Shield, um, use the website a lot to make sure doctors are in network, um, I called the 1-800 number several times with questions about benefits, and everything's been really simple. If we, you know, the, the whole thing with insurance or any other service you have is that service behind the scenes. You know, I'm sure there's many carriers out there selling insurance, but when you can pick up the phone and you can get an answer and it's, you know, it's prompt, uh, that, that means a lot.